and we're going. We are so going. Yeah, these Sentinels got nothing on me. Oh, they got something on me. They got a lot on me. Please tell me I can take off. Oh, I can't take off. That's bad. Hey folks, and welcome back to After Work Gaming. Tonight, we're back in No Man's Sky, and we're on this extreme hazard planet. We've checked out the facility, and what I want to do, actually, is I want to take off, and I want to go to the nearby... I want to go to the nearby station. Now, the reason I want to do that is I have an entire inventory full of stuff, and I just want to clear it out. And then we'll see. Maybe we'll stick around in the system. Maybe we'll go. But I think in terms of self-made goals, our goal is let's get a better ship. Let's upgrade the ship, and let's just kit it out, right? Either for combat or for exploration or whatever. Now, I also wanted to do this because I want to show you a couple of new mods that I've installed since last time. It involves more ships, so I think it's called Busier Space. And then it's also a different space mod to make space darker, to make it... I used to... Uh, I was using Immersive Space last time, but this is called, I think, Better Space. So, we're going to test this out. If it is too dark, by the way, because it, it is darker than Immersive Space, from what I can tell, if it is too dark for you guys, just let me know. And, you know, we can go back to the old one. If it's just too dark with either one, again, let me know. Please don't pull me down. Please don't pull me down. Please don't pull me down. There we go. It has a tendency to curve me in because of the, the planet's gravity. Um, but in any case, if it's too dark, just let me know. I can always take out, you know, all mods or some mods. What is this? What an odd little... What an odd, odd station. Was, uh, I'm assuming this is going to be the... Uh, this can't be the Vakian. I was about to say, this seems like the Vakian, but it's not. Because theirs, I believe... Corvax? Maybe a Corvax station. Uh, yeah, it says scan the system. We'll do that after I drop off all of this stuff. And also check out what is behind the Atlas 1... Atlas Level 1 pass door in the station. And then we're going to go about, you know, doing our thing. Right, all right, all right, all right, all right. Let's actually check out the door first. There we are. Okay. Interesting. Isotopes. I think I can get some money here. 600 credits, fine. Uh, what is this? Multi-tool. Okay, better beam focus. That's cool. And then we can upgrade our inventory. Here we go. It's gonna cost me, isn't it? Yes. Uh, well, we got we got money for days. Let's just go ahead and get that. I guess this is the way to reliably upgrade your inventory so that you don't have to worry about, you know, uh, finding those drop pods, right? The shelters, I think. Oh. Oh, okay, never mind. I thought that was a door. I'm sorry, that's my mistake. All right, let's make sure. I'm pretty sure these are all hidden behind more. Yeah, this is a version 3. And I think this might actually just be version 2 back here. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Version also version three. Well, what do you what do you know? Let's grab some isotopes while I'm here. Not a lot, but you know, you never know who the merchant is. Maybe he's gonna give us a little a little present or something, and we want to talk to him again. All right, let's just go down and go back up. I do hope that you know, uh, Hello Games has patched this here and there. I mean, they patch the bugs, right? I hope that when they do the content patches that they decide to change these staircases or put something else here, you know? Maybe, like, just add more... kind of neat, but not neat enough for me to covet it. There, yeah, there's... Oh, no, it is... It is a Vakian. What do you know? Hey, man. What's up? Okay. This bump, I hear ya. Uh, what is this device? A hundred bucks, 150 really, if you want to be sticklers. What's this thing? Yeah, another 200. Interesting. Interesting. Let's talk to you first. Recruit wands. Current for Kian standing, special relationship. Hoi! Be a Dexoi warrior. Doksan... Ki warrior. Weapon. Ayojinsha Anagjog. 
Uh, the warrior seems furious with itself. It slams its multi-tool on a nearby surface and pulls the trigger again and again, but nothing happens. All weapon systems look functional, but their end result is nothing more than a hollow and empty click. The life form howls in self-loathing. I really? I don't have Thamium? Okay, fine. The outraged warrior headbutts me. Hey, man. Okay, just because I don't have... Ow! Well, alright. Fine, then. I'm just selling all my stuff. Fine. I'm upset with that guy now. System. <laughs> this station sucks. Alright, let's just go ahead and sell. Uh, Radnox. Yes. Uh, you know, I was looking and waiting to maybe sell this stuff, but it feels like we can just... We're gonna start finding this stuff more and more. But let's, uh, let's just go ahead to Starship Inventory. Atlas Stone, we're not selling. Nope. Our canister, we yeah. The Gragra, we yeah. The Emerald, yes. The Iridium, yes. You know, I sell all this stuff, and then I get into a scrap with some pirates or something, and boom, I'm back on. I'm back on what the? I do have. I have Thamium. What? The, oh, I guess fifty. Yeah. Am I just too far from my ship that I can't? I just can't like transfer it. Mine. Platinum. Yeah. Okay. Uh. Can I craft? Can I craft stuff right now? Yes, I can. What else can I craft? Craft electron vapor. Can I craft anything else? I can craft more electron vapor. Craft anything else? No. Let's sell that electron vapor because it feels like uh, that seems to be pricey, right? Uh, sell this, please. Sell them two. So they're four grand each. Um, mm, they're not that price. Well, yeah, screw it. Screw it. Let's just sell it all. I got my, I got my warp cell, and you. you gonna be nice now. Interloper, rupsh, udi biking the hab hai, ugar ua jungs. Um. The warrior stares at me in anticipation of a grave insult to its ancestry. This is the last time, isn't it? It's about to back away when, it face, when its face turns. It delivers a sequence of amused yelps at my hesitation before indicating that it is open to further conversation. Press shield recharge, request healing, request oxide. Yeah, heal me, man. Okay, he agrees to help. Thank you. After headbutting me, it's the least you can do. This is now a version, what? Version 3. Everything here is version 3. Man. Also, it really feels like the controls get super sensitive inside structures. Is that just me, or does, does it seem that way to you guys now? After, like, a patch or something. Alright, and we're alone in the station just as well. Let's get in the ship. Let's just double check where our inventory's at. And maybe... Make a quick rummage. Okay, so that's our multi-tool. Can we install anything else? We need more... Okay. Um, scanner boost? No, we don't really care about that, do we? Go exosuit. Okay, we, get, we should just might as well fuel our hyperdrive. Um, plutonium we need, carbon we don't need, platinum we don't need, iridium we don't need. And the more important thing is, in the ship, they all stack higher. So, let's get out of this station, and let's take a look. I mean, maybe, 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 we can decide what's up. Now, we've visited this state, this planet already. Let's see what else there is. Okay, all right, easy. Easy now. Easy, guys. Um, we haven't, we haven't been there, and we haven't been there, and... Okie dokie then. Uh, like a half dozen, a dozen, well no, it's it's like ten ships or so just warp straight in my face. Okay. Let's go, you know what, let's hit the moon. I kind of want to check it out because I've, I've heard rumor that moons are cooler sometimes than the planets they orbit. But let's check out the moon first anyway. Because why the heck not, right? Maybe we're not the only ones to think that like going to the moon would be cool. I mean, we'll find some stuff. Now, before we actually go to the plant, uh, go to the moon, I want to mine up some asteroids because I need some thomium in case we need to recharge our systems. 
that hostile planet kind of took it out of us because your environmental protection would just go down so quick, right? And then we can... Yeah, can we... Sh we want to scan the system? Not really. I, th I, I think the joy in this episode is going to be just bumbling around and seeing what we can find on our own. And now, two seconds in, let's just back it down real quick. Whoa, 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 easy, easy, easy. Let's just start taking out these guys. Yep. The reason I want to do this is, like I said, I want some Thelmium, so that if I have to recharge my, my systems... Anything? Yep, 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 yep. That should be enough. Now we just point straight, and in case anything comes at us, I'm just gonna take it out. I'm gonna plow the. I'm gonna uh, plow the road? Yeah, I guess that's the right term for it. We're gonna mow the lawn here. Let's go. Five seconds until entry. Four, three, two, boom. Now. I want to point out, the Big Things mod, Alcinol VC-37. Oh, and we're heading straight to a facility, check that out. Now, the Big Things mod, the thing that makes all the trees huge, there's like gold on this planet, uh, has been updated so that the pop-in should be better. It doesn't mean it's going to solve anything, oh, 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 easy, but it's going to be better in the sense of it should pop in less now. Let's just go ahead and land. Yeah, this doesn't really have... This isn't as exciting as I thought, guys. I'm sorry. But I do see... I do spy with my little eye. Let me... Easy. Easy, easy, easy. What is that? What is that? Go ahead and, and go over here. Whoa. Whoa, a Gravitino ball. Oh, what now? What? 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 Come on. Jeez. Guys, just don't... What? There's a walker here? All I wanted was a ball. Yeah, 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 you gonna mess? You gonna mess? Oh, yes, he is gonna mess. In a serious way. I am running. I'm running to this facility now. Shush! Shush! Everybody off. Everybody off of me right now. Let me in, 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 let me in. Whoa. Yeah, it's abandoned. But it's better than being out there with these guys. Restore my shields, please. Thank you. Um, what did I just pick up? The Gravitino ball. Why are they so antsy and they're pantsy? Supersymmetric particle cluster. Extremely rare and valuable product of divergent supergravitational forces. A value of 27,000 and a half. Okay, well. Yes. That might... That might, uh, uh, get the heat on me, as we say, or as some say. Alright, this is a sample. Let's just pick up the sample real quick. Uh, what's in here? Assuming it's going to be some sort of warp cell material. Journey milestone accomplished. Yes, but what did I get? I, I don't care about the milestone, I just want to know what I got. <laughs> what did I get? Scrapper destroyed five sentinels. I just destroyed one of them, the little flying one. I couldn't even take down... What's-his-face? Walker. Yes. Also, still, what did I get? Suspension fluid. Eh, well, alright. Not surprising, I suppose. Alright, let's go ahead and check out what technology is here. Derelict, the bending building. Uh, returning user identified, etc. Okay. Where did the Sentinels come from? No ships ever uh, are ever seen arriving to deposit them, yet we know they have spatial drives and can appear on any planet. Do they build themselves from resources in the world that they infest? Like a mechanoid virus drawing on the host body to metastasize new matter? 
Horvax science speaks of metals in their makeup that should not exist in our age of the universe. No one has ever seen them built. They are simply here as if the universe expresses them into existence. Okay. Well, the Vikian don't like him at all. I discovered something coded deep inside the long... Okay. What's the tech? Come on. All right, come on. Uh-huh. Enhanced, uh, enhanced r uh, running capacity. Stamina, I guess. Okay. That's interesting. I don't know what any of that means. Uh, what is this? I think this is an encyclopedia, right? Yes. Uh, huh, the Vikian word for remuneration. Something I do... Eh, sometimes. Another milestone accomplished. Well, that's not going to stop me from opening all of these plutonium boxes. Because... Why, why the heck are we not, right? And that's it. Oh, no, wait. No, there's another box. And that opens, and power canister. Okay. All right, so let's get out of here, and let's see what we can find on this planet without the Sentinels essentially smacking me down immediately. Right? Easy? Easy, man. Easy. Uh... Yeah? No? Nobody wants that. Nobody wants that. We're all friends here. Okay, so we're going to go check out that shelter. And we're going to be on the lookout. Maybe there are other Gravitino Balls, so maybe we can grab a bunch and get the... There are two of these pods, huh? Well, I, everything is... I'm sorry, my, my frame rate is atrocious down here. Is it because of the mods? This is unfortunate. Alright, let's go, just go check this out. I know there was another ball, but that walker is like close by and I don't want to start getting... You know, I don't want to start rumbling with them. It's not my thing. These are big crystals. And there's another ball. Okay. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Let me just see something. We're not actually going to do anything here. We're going to purchase another piece of... Uh, oops. Get another one of these. Another suit upgrade. Uh, by the way, I'm sorry guys, I'm gonna try and fix the frame rate. I'm gonna figure out what exactly is causing this thing to go. So 30,000, okay, that's fine. Go ahead and buy me. There's something else in here, anything else in here? Nope, just panels. Okay. Uh, we're not gonna harvest up that th That guy is really close. I'm not gonna mess with him right now. Let's see what else does I got in the cargo. Fascination bead, fine. A little health restore. Sure. This should probably be more warp material. Nothing. Well, or it's going to be nothing. Alright, let's go ahead and save our game. Because we're about to do something monumentally stupid, which is... Knowing that there are hostile sentinels around, we are going to go and steal another one of these Gravitino balls. And lo and behold, I'm going to guess that we're going to get some sentinels immediately coming at us. Like, from nowhere in particular. Yeah, 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 I see it. I see it, man, okay? Just, I'm just, I'm just scoping the place out. What is that, though? That copper? Maybe? Hmm. Yep, okay, I just wanted to do that. Yeah, we got a three, we got three strikes on us. Alright, we're not messing with this. Oh! To the ship, to the ship! You're looking for us? Good, look, keep looking for us. I'm going here. Up. Up, 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 up. Oh. Um. Come on, come on. Plutonium. Yes, go. Go, 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 go. Woo! Okay. All right, all right, all right, all right, all right. What? Why are we only going up? This is not helping. This is not helpful. Do we think we have space for another one of these balls? Because, I mean, we can do, like, this snatch-and-grab operation on this planet, I think. We'll probably get away with that a little here and there. In the meantime, what else we got? This could also be... Oh, 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 speaking of ships. Speaking of crash-landed ships, let's see what we got. 
Aside from the fact that this one looks ugly as sin. Let's just see if it's worth our time, or if we'll just scrap it, you know, use it for scrap here. Uh, 16 slot. Compare it with ours? The 15 slots. And what do we got here? 3, 6, 9, 10. Definitely got fewer, although we can probably cannibalize some of these, right? Eh, no. If we could be but we could do better. And let's try and go for something better. Famous last words, right? Like, <laughs> am I infuriating all of you? Just go ahead and drop a comment if I'm just like, you're like, why? You just, you just, you said you wanted a new ship. Why don't you just take one with, like, one or two extra... What? Uh, yeah, let's recharge that, thanks. Okay, cool. Um, give me the debris. But I, I said, first off, if I'm gonna trade up for a 16 slot from 15 slot, it better look better than that, right? Because that thing looks like a clunker. Uh, I'm greeted by the stench of rotting flesh as I enter the derelict vessel's Spartan interior. A huge beast dressed in what appears to be military uniform lies where it died, mere feet from the escape hatch. Behind it is a partially smashed rack of military multi-tools, secured by a sparking alien locking mechanism. The cockpit door hangs slightly ajar and I can see operational equipment inside. So, when it's sparking, meh, meh, no. So I am going to go to the cockpit. A pilot lies slumped across the control panel. I wrench a ship tech from beneath it. Stench of decay forces me to leave. Uh, I got better guns, basically. Okay. Um. Hold on. Where are we with our suit? Okay, I got plenty of space. Plenty, plenty, plenty of space. Here we go. Before I take that and incur the wrath, is there anything that I want to mark off as being cool that I should investigate before this? No. Go ahead and point ourselves in the direction of our ship, and we're going. We are so going. Yeah, these sentinels got nothing on me. Oh, they got something on me. They got a lot on me. Please tell me I can take off. Oh, I can't take off. That's bad. <laughs> um. Right? I'm in my ship. Leave me alone. I'm in my ship. In my ship. In my ship. Promotes efficient power usage. Okay, can we move this to the ship? And we restore... Ow! They are sh they are firing on my ship. No. Okay. Uh, I really sh should have thought this one through. Let's just run. Yeah. Ah, I see. Easy, easy. <laughs> We're gonna just snatch and grab as much as we can. Let's go. Give me the grenades. The grenades. There we go. Yes. Yes, fine. Boom. You guys got nothing. I got all this plutonium. You guys got a lot. You guys got a lot. I keep I keep saying you have nothing. Yes, 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 yes. Come on. Oh, come on. Up, 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 up. There's another ball? Again? Already? <sighs> nope. We're not hanging around for them. Sorry. Lose the cops. I kind of... I said there were no interesting formations, but first of all, there's a huge facility over here. It's not really huge. This is just a... factory. Hmm. So let's go check out this... Oh, these guys have walkers here, though. Hmm. I like these tabletop things. Those are kind of cool formations. We'll come back to that factory in a second. Let's just hit the deck here. What is going on? I keep you can see I'm flying and I'm just like going up. Weird. Weird, weird, weird. It seems like it's almost like something's not loading in properly. A little. Where this game's like fighting with me about something. What's over here? Is the transmission tower? Whoa, okay. Um, here's what we're gonna do. We're gonna remember that there is a... Running really slowly. I don't like it. I don't like it! Uh, so we're gonna remember there's a tower, there's a factory here. 
And we're gonna go right there. Down, down, down. And... Okay. Good enough. Sentinel Force is deactivated. Let's do this. I'm gonna go ahead and activate the beacon here, and we're gonna call it there. We're gonna check out this huge facility next time. Way over there. Um, we're gonna check out this huge facility next time, and then we're gonna remember that there's a factory, and we're gonna go there. And then maybe, maybe, maybe we'll actually hop, skip, and jump over to... we not see it from here? Maybe we're on the dark side of the moon? Far side, rather? Uh, to the planet that this thing is orbiting. So there we go. Activated the beacon. Okay. And with that... And with that... I hope you enjoyed this episode. If you did, like, comment, subscribe. Let's me know that, you know, I'm doing something right. And let's me know that you want to see more of this stuff. If you think I should do something different, if you think I'm an idiot for passing up the ship, or if you think there's a better way to dealing with the Sentinels than just flat out, you know, snatching stuff and running away from them, uh, let me know. Uh, all comments are welcome. Uh, and in any case, I will see you all next time.